came away from the slope. Previously on SV Sarian, we dodged container ships and enjoyed a stonking sail to Hardy Reef. Then Darren dived on below to see what gems he could find. Well, what a beautiful morning after a bit of a rock and roll night. <laughs> no, it wasn't too bad. <laughs> I woke up, I felt like my, my neck had been all scrunched up into my head or something. It was pretty funny. <laughs> but it's been a gorgeous morning and the swells dropped out and the winds dropped out. So we came out here on the perfect day and we're just going to go off to Bait Reef and check out a place called the Stepping Stones, but we are in the middle of nowhere. It is beautiful, isn't it, my honey? Oh, it's fantastic. How lucky mm. are we? <laughs> <laughs> what happened here? <laughs> well, Mingy's amazing little technolo technological device failed when she broke it. So we're on to plan number two, using our gorilla pod. We'll see if this works. <laughs> Pretty funny. Ow. China.com isn't that isn't that um Perfect. Isn't proving to be that sturdy, but this should do the trick. Enough. I wouldn't shake it too hard. <laughs> That's what happened to the other one. <laughs> That's right. Anyway, send us some good vibes. <laughs> so here we are and we are just traveling along. It is beautiful smooth waters. It is a gorgeous sunny day. I've just been sitting here pondering how lucky we are and it's so such a good feeling to be out again on the Great Barrier Reef and um, it is just as magical as they say. We're in, a, in between driving through a whole lot of reef systems at the moment and we're about to end up in the middle of a lagoon and <laughs> just such special times, such special times hanging out in the middle of nowhere just Darren and I. Just lovely. <laughs> anyway, we're just coming around the uh, edge of the lagoon, or edge of Bait Reef, and uh, I better go and uh, better get my bommy head on, because we've got a bit of a trek to come through. Uh, to get in, we sort of have to come around what they call the stepping stones, and, and then uh, come into this sort of quite tight area apparently by what it looks like on the chart and then pick up a mooring. We should be happy as clams and go snorkeling for the afternoon. Be lovely. Beautiful day. Beautiful day. over there, looking uh, most inviting I must say. Bait Reef is about 40 nautical miles sail east from Airlie Beach on the edge of the Great Barrier Reef. It's best to sail out on an outgoing tide aiming to reach the reef at noon which we found provided better visibility when coming into the lagoon. There are underwater caves, canyons and swim-throughs and in some areas shallow waterways host beautiful hard and soft corals over large sandy patches. We were excited to discover what lay beneath these beautiful waters.
We had a great welcoming committee of two reef birds who seemed to be living on a mooring and a big black giant trevally who monitored proceedings under the boat. There he is. Look at that. <laughs> Look at you! Oh. After lunch, we took off to explore the lagoon with its large drop-offs and beautiful coral waterways. Today we are snorkelling the cluster of four, which mark the entrance into the lagoon. The fish life is plentiful and we were delighted to see large schools of bait fish, giant trevally, reef sharks, coral trout, sweet lips and many other species of fish.
That was amazing. <laughs> I've never seen so many awesome fish. Such colourful fish and they're just cruising around, just hanging out, just being fish. Like, oh, I'm a fish. <laughs> Here I am eating, <laughs> cruising about. It's just, oh, beautiful. I'm just, that's amazing. Yeah, they were so friendly. <laughs> you, were just, you couldn't believe it. They didn't it. care. They were so casual, yeah. weren't they? Oh, just, a, just great. We're just hanging out going, hello. <laughs> what about that shark? Yeah, that little white tip reefy. Yeah, awesome. He didn't really care either. He said, well, what are you guys doing here? <laughs> exactly. This is beautiful. It's just so beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so how good was the fish life there? That was just amazing. Oh, unbelievable. I've, I've never seen so many fish in one place. It, you know, I've dived in a lot of places and that, that really takes the cake. And it's really, really impressive. Just amazing. The variety of fish life. It's just so good it's uh, great that they've made it a green zone so that a lot of the fish can actually uh, the species can actually survive and grow it's just fantastic and cheeky oh, <laughs> yeah they're friendly <laughs> as I've certainly got no fear of uh, snorkelers or divers it's... yeah oh, I just think the whole underworld is fascinating I could just hang out there for hours just watching different fish and how they eat off the coral and how they all interact with each other just amazing yeah yeah. So look, if you're a muso and you feel that your music would suit our videos, please drop us a line um, and we'd love to help share your music with the world. So as always, thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please drop a comment below. We'd love to hear from you. Get some feedback from you would be great. Um, please share our video with your friends and colleagues if you think they'd love it. And uh, yeah. Give us the old thumbs up and please subscribe. So until next week, thanks so much. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a great week. Look at one poor lip. Oh, it's true. all sunburned. True. Oh. <laughs>